Here at Learn Electrics, we are often asked about adding extra lighting switches, especially after building modifications to a property or extra access points into a room. This short video is intended to show you how an existing two-way lighting circuit can be quickly and easily upgraded. Intermediate lighting is used to control the same lighting points from three or more light switches. Any number of light switches can be incorporated provided a few basic rules are followed. We will be using the three plate method here as recommended in the current wiring publications. In this video we will convert a two-way lighting circuit into a three switch intermediate circuit. But an intermediate circuit can be built from scratch just by following these same drawings. We also have in-depth videos on one-way and two-way lighting on our Learn Electrics channel and we will leave links in the description to this video. We are going to install an intermediate switch, sometimes called a crossover switch. This type of switch has four terminal holes in the back. As can be seen in the top drawing, current flows along the brown wire from L1 to L3 and also flows along the grey wires from L2 to L4. Different manufacturers may mark the terminals with alternative letters or numbers. Operating the switch causes the outputs to cross over. L1 now feeds L4 on the grey wire and L2 feeds the brown wire on L3. Let's begin by looking at our existing two-way circuit. Voltage enters the circuit from the ceiling rows and depending on the position of the switches the output voltage back to the ceiling rows is switched on and off. As an example, let's assume that our customer has knocked a doorway through to the garage and now wants the kitchen switches extended to the garage doorway. We are going to add a switch as shown here by the checkered box. The first thing to do is to remove the light switch shown on the right here. Keep it, we will reuse it shortly. But leave the strapper wires in place, we need those left where they are. We will now replace this two-way switch with an intermediate switch over the next few slides. At this stage we should have something like this. Now install the intermediate switch into the space where the removed two-way switch was. Add another three core plus earth strapper wire from this switch to the new switch, in our example the new garage doorway. And position the previously removed two-way switch by the garage door. That is the most difficult bit over with, finding a route to run the new cable. Now we can start wiring up. Using a small terminal block, connect the two black wires at the middle switch. Use the smallest convenient sized terminal block as this has to fit inside the switch box on the wall. Now connect up the two browns to L1 and L3 and the two grey cables to L2 and L4. Make sure of your wiring here. If you are unsure of the marking protocol of the switch, it is very easy to test the switching order of the switch with the low ohms range of your test meter. At the new switch, the last switch, connect the black to the common terminal and the brown and grey, one each, into the remaining terminals. And that is it, finished. All that's left now is to inspect and test your work and issue a minor work certificate. You can add any number of switches to the lighting circuit, 3, 4, 5, 10, 20, but you must abide by the following rule. The first and last switch must be a two-way switch. All the light switches in between must be intermediate types. And this slide should serve to illustrate that point. If you need a reminder on two-way lighting, our video, Two-Way Lighting, gives some very in-depth training on this subject as does our one-way lighting video and we will leave links in the description to this video. Well that's it. We hope that you've enjoyed this video and learnt a little more. Please click on subscribe below to have access to all of our videos and to be sure of not missing our next Tech Tips video. Subscribing also helps us too and it makes us feel that our efforts are worthwhile. Typing in Learn Electrics, all one word, into the YouTube search bar will also give you access to all of our videos at any time. Thank you for watching and we hope to see you again very soon.